Here I have an HO scale weigh station with a readout in pounds. When it's green, it's within a plus or minus tolerance of uh, a target, which I'll explain in a minute. I have a laser here and a laser over here that'll measure the box car length. If I put the box car on, we get a mass in scale pounds. So 144700 pounds. If I uh, change the mode here, change the input mode to length, and I get a measurement of uh, 168 millimeter based on the distance between that laser and the end of this box car. That laser and the end of this box car minus the distance between the two then come down here and in order to enter that value I press zero in pound and it puts in that distance 165 millimeter and the target weight of this car is 120.4 grams per NMRI standard based on their calculation. If I go back, I can go back to the mass. Also, if you can't get a good reading on a length with the laser, depending on if there's things at the end here, over here, like a caboose or something, you can measure it uh, with a scale. You can actually type in 164, enter, and it gives you the calculation in grams. And then, uh, like I said, if you have it where it needs to be, per the standard, the green light will be on if it's plus or minus a few grams. I think uh, maybe I have it like half a gram or one gram. I can't remember. <laughs> the last part is uh, if I have it in measurement mode, I can also clear out the uh, length and then put in a new length if I want. So let's say it's 225 millimeter. Yeah, it should weigh 153.9 grams. These are all just targets based on NMRI, NMRI standards um, that help your rolling stock run better. So I thought, why not do two parts? One part for a nice display for the weigh station and two parts for the uh, calculation and being able to actually balance these. And then uh, I've created this so I can swing it out of the way. So it doesn't get clipped by any passer buyers. Swing it right back and we're good comment below. And uh, I can give information on how I did this if anybody's interested. There's a base uh, Arduino setup. There's a scale underneath here, I've got some pictures of that. There's an Arduino in here uh, to make the display and take the keyboard inputs. And then this display is run separately 